Thank you for joining us for Fox 2 News at 5. I'm Mandy Murphy. And I'm Vic Faust. First on Fox at 5 tonight, an update on coronavirus in our area right now. There is now a new possible case in the city of St. Louis. A private school in the Central West End is closed today after it was revealed that a parent of a student was tested. This case follows the presumptive confirmed case that we told you about yesterday in St. Louis County. And we're also watching for developments in the case involving a Bayer employee. And there are also four possible cases we're tracking in St. Charles County. To bring us up to speed, let's go live to Fox News' Kelly Hoskins. Kelly? A man named Vic, we're here at the St. Charles County Emergency Operations Center where they're still waiting for some of those test results to come back. But in fact, they're also monitoring the cases around the world here from John Hopkins University. And since we've been here, the numbers continue to change by the minute. In fact, we talked with local officials here in the area about the precautionary measures that they're taking to keep our residents safe. One of the most recent concerns in the city of St. Louis, a parent of a student at a private school in the Central West End traveled recently to a country where coronavirus has been an issue and hasn't been feeling well since being back in St. Louis. The parent was tested Sunday for the coronavirus and the results should be back today. Meanwhile, in St. Louis County continues to deal with one of the presumed positive cases of coronavirus, saying the family broke the quarantine, which the family disagrees. As a result, the two schools have been closed, Bill Duchenne and Oak Hill School. Administrators learned that the woman presumably affected with the coronavirus is the older sister of a Bill Duchenne student. Reportedly, the father of the family under quarantine attended a father-daughter dance on Saturday night at the Ritz-Carlton in Clayton. Meanwhile, in Creed Corps, Bear temporarily closed its campus until further notice. Following read automotive Skyfox flew over Bear, the closure is to implement additional cleaning measures in common areas as a proactive measure of abundance. Precaution as the employee is being tested for the coronavirus. And over in St. Charles, five patients are being tested. One who just returned from Mexico is in the hospital in isolation. There's also one patient who just returned from Germany is currently under self-isolation. One patient who just returned from Washington State is currently under self-isolation. And we talk with officials about what they're doing to make sure the public feels safe. Look, we have some of the best health care facilities in the nation here in the city of St. Louis and tons of resources. Uh, but it's important that we collaborate at this point in time as a region to address this thing. We've um, added information to our website. We're reaching out to um, community groups that we feel need um, some special attention, like nursing homes and school districts. Um, we are, have also pulled together all of um, our law enforcement officers. And back out here live, taking a live look at the numbers of the confirmed coronavirus cases around the world, from Italy to Iran, to France, to Spain, to the United States. As we mentioned, the numbers continue to increase. And anyone who has questions or concerns about uncertain or exposure should contact your local health department and our doctor. And if you're experiencing those symptoms, you should await their instructions at home, according to health experts. Live in St. Charles County, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News.